Hello students, welcome to detention. It's good to see that you are all here. Please no talking and remain in your seats for the next hour. Oh, look at you, what a cute little kitty you are. Yes, you are, yes you are. Oh, you are so fluffy, I could die. Really? Yep, Isaac, you are totally good with the ladies. I'm going to murder you. But that's illegal, right? <sighs> so, are we all set for tonight? I think so, as long as everything goes as planned. Okay, so Heidi is going to be following Franks with Jenna, and Bay is coming with Nick and I so we can break back into that room. What about me? Well, we just needed to ask you some questions about the hunter you saw. You already told us everything you knew. He had a weird sensor-looking thing, a gun, and you mentioned several times how scary he was. You guys don't need me anymore, huh? Kara, it's not that- It's okay, honestly. Hey, what's up? Nothing. Kara, are you- Hey, Jet, you should come back here. But I'm with- Go sit with Isaac. So, what do you think of Ryder? What? Till douchebag, huh? What? That is where you nod your head and agree with me! <laughs> this isn't funny. <laughs> right, it's hysterical. You're gossiping like a 13-year-old girl. He thinks he has Bay falling head over heels for him. Oh no, not this again. You know how it is. Yeah, but don't you think it's time to move on? She would have. <sighs> Never mind, I don't want to talk about it. And he kissed me. <laughs> oh, Kara. I'm so happy for you. It was so weird, and it was like electrifying. <laughs> so I'll take it your first kiss with Jet was great? It was better than great. I mean, I didn't even think a guy would ever like me. Yeah. Hey, about the plan. We just don't want too many people involved. It may look suspicious then. Seriously, it's fine, Melly. I'm just all over the place right now. <laughs> I noticed. So, you're really the Alpha's daughter? Yep. The what was it like? I, I don't know. It was normal. It was home. I don't really know how to describe it. Is coming here to Houseful really weird then? Kinda. Being in a pack is more... comfortable. You know everyone. Know where they stand. Everyone is respected. It's organized. Being in a pack? I don't even know where I'll go, where I'll be accepted. <laughs> don't say that. There's always a place for everyone. I wish I could think that. So, why don't you tell me more about your moment with Jet? <laughs> you really want to know? Why not? I think it's sweet. Thanks for getting your cousin in with the plan. Oh, it was no problem. Just had to persuade her with some cookies. <laughs> Are those cookies actually that good? Delicious. <laughs> well, I might have to try some myself. Maybe. So... Do you think this plan is going to work? I hope so. Don't be nervous. Reading my mind, Nicholas? Your thoughts are pretty loud. I just... I have a bad feeling about this.
Look at her. Talking to the PBB in detention. I couldn't be more proud. So, did I get to hear that story now? I don't know. Sure you really want to? I asked, didn't I? Well, let's see. My dad met the step monster and they fell in love. This is where I got dragged out of house full and went back to the pack for their wedding. Everything went well, I guess, but a few days before I was supposed to come back, my dad was one of the wolves that got sent out on that border patrol. You mean... Yeah, the one that ran into the group of hunters. He got shot and we found him dead in the woods. That left me stuck with that bitch he married and I had to help her adjust, along with the pack. Ryder, I'm sorry. Don't apologize. I don't need your sympathy. It's done and over with. I don't know what to say. Then don't say anything. <coughs> What's the matter, Barbie? Wow, you really did become a douchebag, Ryder. Ouch, big mean words coming from such a little girl. You disgust me. Okay. Heidi, why don't you leave us alone? Why don't you let me finish talking to Ryder? Then you can feel free to throw yourself on him. I'd watch it. Ladies, ladies. Oh, shut up, Ryder. When I heard you were coming back, I thought maybe you'd still care. Maybe I thought you wouldn't have turned yourself into a plastic bitch? How can you say that after everything we've been through? <laughs> Easy. I forgot all that nonsense. Care to tell me what's going on? I think it's time you mind your own business, Bay. Don't tell me what to do. Oops, already did. Oh, heavens. Everyone, get back to your seats and please don't fight. Get off me! Calm down, Barbie. She took this way too far. I'm not gonna let her try to burn me again. <laughs> oh, really? Because you aren't doing that great of a job. Enough. I don't know what's going on with all of you, but it needs to stop. You're all acting like little kids. Grow up! Watch it, new girl. Heidi, shush. I think you and Bay should both know there's something a lot more important going on. Something that should stop this nonsense from happening again. Something important, like shopping? Because I'd love to. Oh, back to that again. Rescue mission four. Can you take one thing seriously for a bit longer than five minutes, please? What is going on in here? I don't know. Because you're too busy living in La La Land and acting like a child. You let a student break up a fight. I don't think that's very appropriate thing for you to say. Not now. I need to see Mr. Graham and Miss Smithson outside for a moment. Ooh, you're in trouble! Livia, shush. Well, um, let's get back to being quiet and staying seated, please. Where are you taking us? Outside. Why? It's almost dark. It's fine out there, Miss Smithson. Just be quiet. Why outside? If you need to talk to us, your office should be just fine. Don't question me. We're going out. No. Excuse me? I said no. You're not taking me out there without giving me a reason. Same for Kara. Um, yeah. Same for me. Sorry to burst your bubbles, but I'm the adult in this situation, and you'll do as I say. No. You two better follow, or else. Nick, what do we do? I wouldn't say let's follow her. Something is off. Yeah, I kind of figured that out too. Well, I'm going. Kara. I don't want to find out what the or else option is, Nick. But- I don't care what you do, but I'm going. Why the hell am I doing this? Glad you two came. Just follow. You two have caused me too much trouble. You idiot! It's him! The boy! Not me! Kara! Reed! Get the- 
the boy. Yes, Ace. We can't wait. Tonight is the night. Get all the hunters here now. We have to take over the school. Tonight. That's almost impossible. Almost. I'll let down the rest of the guard around the borders. You have an hour to start taking over the school. Is that even possible, Ace? I guess we have to make it possible. Let's go. Stupid wolf. Good. Tonight is the night. 